Hello, Nomad Sculpt, and this uh, video is about shirt collar. And this is the second video, and this is with a tube tool. Okay, so, okay, something like this here. Okay, this is our base mesh and so now we need the tube tool tube and here I select pass and not closed so these are the settings and here's the snapping is on so this is active so and now I draw a straight line and press the green dot Make sure that here snapping is active here. So, and then place here your tube. So something like this here. And only, yeah, only half the mesh, only here um, to this position here. And then you see here um, at the top, you can activate the profile. So activate profile and now we can use the profile editor. So here, and you see here option for a closed profile so we need an open profile like this here and here you can bring the nodes in position and delete the others and we only need a mesh like this here such a flat band okay So when you press the three dots menu, it's possible to change the topology. So here the, we don't need much. And here, so the lower the topology, the easier is the sculpting. So less vertices, easy is <laughs> equal to easier sculpting. Okay, so here for the profile, it's possible here to add more profiles. So here I'm adding, so I'm adding a node here for for this here. And now when you press so that all three dots are active. So sorry. Now so and now go to the profile editor and here you see this icon here. You press on it and copy this one. And when you press again, then it's possible to paste it to all. Paste. So now Everything is uh, slightly banded. So, okay. Then we need the twist for all positions and the radii for all positions. So, and now we can here start with the radius, make it a little bit bigger. this so and the twist okay and 
then we start to wrap it around. So I'm starting with the editor and we need the last one, this one. And okay. So, and we need more topology. So here we need a little bit more and we can make it round if you like it. So, and this one, oh, sorry. And this one we can copy and paste it at this position. So like this. And again, the next paste. So I think you get it. This one, So let's see what we get. So here in the um, material settings, we can um, select here colored back face off. So then we see it a little bit nicer. So now maybe bring it here. position. Maybe here at the second position. I go here. And add more topology. Maybe like this. So, okay, and the last thing is, so I check now the, here at the top, there's a mirror. I activate the mirror. And here I'm checking the, the overlapping here. So, this okay now I deselect the mirror and I validate this object validate so here in the symmetry so mirror it from right to left so this one and split mirror so now 
the color is is nice and now it's possible to use a little bit move tool and This is the back side, so we have to use inverse culling. It's nice. So inverse culling here, this setting here of okay. So smoothing. So now it's nice. and multi-resolution okay so now I think I mask this object and So let's see, we need the shell. Yeah, I think it looks nice. So this is what you get. So here, and you can remesh it uh, or boolean it um, if you like. Oh, symmetry. Okay. So that's it. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.